Ladies review. New York three days ago, the college basketball world viewed Rutgers as an afterthought, an underachieving bottom feeder. No more. The Scarlet Knights showed how far the infusion of hard hat culture can carry a downtrodden program, pushing eight ranked Purdue to the brink before falling 82-75 in Friday's Big Ten Tournament quarterfinals. Rutgers, 15-19, the 14th seed showed no signs of fatigue despite playing its third game in three days. Third-seeded Purdue, 27-5, was simply a few shots better before a scarlet-red crowd of 13,000 at Madison Square Garden. Rutgers' indefatigable backcourt led the way. Junior Corey Sanders, 23 points, and freshman George Baker, 25 points, played like all Americans. One night after grinding past Indiana and two nights after dispatching Minnesota, the Scarlet Knights looked anything but tired coming out of the gate. They jumped out to a 13-5 lead and took a 38-35 advantage into the half. Purdue countered after the break, ripping off an 11-0 run to take an 8-point lead. But the Scarlet Knights kept coming thanks to relentless work on the glass. They posted a remarkable 22 edge in second chance points. Purdue advances to face seventh seeded Penn State, 21 12, which sits squarely on the NCAA tournament bubble. The contest tips at 4 30 p.m. on CBS. Top seeded Michigan and fifth seeded Michigan State square off in the other semi final, which tips at 2 p.m. The last time Rutgers reached the NCAA tournament was 1991. Their 27-year drought is the longest of any high major program. The highest-ranked opponent Rutgers ever knocked off away from home remains number 8 UCLA in 1981 at the Meadowlands. The last time Rutgers reached the semi-final of a conference tournament was 1998 a 64-50 loss to 6th-ranked Connecticut in the Big East semis.